carbon and its compounds as your day begins you need toothpaste soap milk bread paper pencil shoes uniform cosmetics petrol rice rotis etc these are the important things you need for your daily routine isn't it here i have a question do you find anything common among them yes they are all made up of carbon compounds compounds that have carbon as their constituent are called carbon compounds so in this video we are going to learn some interesting points about carbon and its compounds before that if you haven't subscribed to our channel please subscribe and press the bell icon to get all the latest updates carbon is the fourth most abundant substance in universe and 15th most abundant substance in the earth's crust the earth's crust has 0.18% of carbon in the form of minerals like carbonates coal and petroleum and the atmosphere has 0.03% of carbon dioxide the crystalline forms of elemental carbon are graphite diamond and fullerenes these are the allotropic forms of carbon carbon is an element with atomic number 6 it has 6 protons and 6 electrons its electronic configuration is 2 4 The free electrons in its outermost shell are 4. So the valency of carbon is 4. It has to either lose 4 electrons or gain 4 electrons to attain stability. But it is very difficult for the carbon atom to do so. So carbon forms covalent bond with other elements to make carbon compounds. Covalent bonds are weaker than ionic bonds. So carbon compounds have less melting point and boiling points compared to ionic compounds. Example sugar 186 degrees celsius salt 801 degrees celsius carbon has the unique ability to form bonds with other atoms of carbon giving rise to large molecules this property is called catenation these compounds may have long chains of carbon branched chains of carbon or even carbon atoms arranged in rings in addition carbon atoms may be linked by single double or triple bonds Compounds of carbon which are linked by only single bonds between the carbon atoms are called saturated carbon compounds. Compounds of carbon having double or triple bonds between their carbon atoms are called unsaturated carbon compounds. The hydrogens in hydrocarbon chain are replaced by certain functional groups and form a wide variety of compounds like carboxylic acids, alcohols, esters, aldehydes, ketones, etc. So we have seen some general properties of carbon and its compounds in this video. We will explore the chemical properties of carbon in detail in the next video. Thanks for watching. If you like the video, give us a like, post your comments and share this video to your friends.